Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So today we have um, some tool that is going to be helpful for phones that don't have a browser or that their browser just is not that great, like the Vortex V3. You probably won't be able to search things, but sometimes you wanna search things. You wanna get some information on the go, um, like addresses or whatnot. So for example, here I'm going to show you what this does. So I can type, um, so address for mango tree coffee. And this is a local coffee shop here in the Denver area. And when you text it, you will receive a text message that is pretty easy to kind of parse. So the address for mango tree coffee is such and such, and they give you the phone number. So if you need it, so for example, the light phone three does have a directory, so that is helpful, but your phone may not, you may only have a simple flip phone and you know, you want to get that address without having to, you know, wander around, you just send a text message and it's pretty quick. You can also get recipes, so a recipe for bean salad, for simple bean salad drain and rinse three kinds of beans, kidney, chickpeas, cannellini, you know, you get some mustard, olive oil, vinegar. So it essentially grabs information from the web and it condenses it so that you have the ability to use it. I believe the engine that they're using is perplexity. So you can search more and their pricing is uh, pretty affordable to a large degree because they're doing something very simple, right? So they're not trying to get the most out of it. So it's about $3 a month and you have unlimited searches. You can get the information from the web and it's not like a chat bot, right? Like, so it is kind of like AI is summarizing some of these things via perplexity but it's not a chat bot. And then you can request, for example, game score. So game seven NBA right there. So you get to send it and then you get a response and it's pretty fast. So, you know, it does pretty much what it needs to do right there. The 2025 NBA finals yesterday, Thunder won. Um, and right there it gives you kind of like oh it, there was an injury so some extra context to what happened yesterday there is also the ability to get the weather so you have to be precise you can not only put weather it will not grab your location so if you put weather it will give you kind of like a generic what weather is so you know weather is probably referring to this or that but if you put weather in your city you will get th that forecast for the day so like right here currently the u.s has experienced excessive heat so it's kind of like a general weather of the United States instead of your specific weather. Uh, but if you want to get your specific weather, then you go back and then you go like weather, Denver, and then, you know, you can put today or forecast and it will give you kind of like an idea of what is coming. There are other services um, I will showcase to you after this text um, happens. Uh, so weather in Denver today is mostly cloudy with a high chance uh, 50 percent of showers are thunderstorms so there you go uh, around 79 uh, fahrenheit you know kind of like t telling you what's going to be i probably gotta get a little bit um hotter uh, depending on the cloud cover you know and that kind of stuff there is another one that i'm showcasing to you it's uh, a little bit more power packed uh it's called light friend it does have more of extra functionality like whatsapp emails calendar tasks perplexity search as well, photo analysis, translation, QR code reader. A, a lot of things that, um, I mean, I don't think it's a bad thing <laughs> necessarily, but it's kind of like, well, uh, what is it that I need to be doing? The QR code reader seems cool, you know, but it just depends on what you want to be doing. The pricing is a little bit more um, depending on your needs. So for example, when it comes to the basic stuff, right? So up to 10 messages, $10 or 10 euros per month gives you 10 messages or minutes per day, uh, auto top up and includes internet search. So when it comes to the basic plan, if you're going to be getting the basic plan, I highly recommend you get the text that search it because that's $3 for the same functionality. Now, if you want more functions like um, WhatsApp, email, calendar, tasks, um, you know, notifications or kind of like support and all of that stuff, then you can get the other one, which is 50 a month. But that is to me a little bit too much money 
for what it is 15 messages a day. I don't like that it is mm, rated at such a, I mean, maybe they're using more resources or whatnot. So that's why I'm recommending TC because it's kind of like, oh, hey, you get unlimited searches for three bucks a month instead of a very expensive plan. But if you need more functionality and you don't plan to use it often, you know, throughout the day, I definitely think light friend can be, can be helpful for you. Um, anyways, I hope that you are able to find some usefulness in this video and that this helps you in what you need to do for your dumb phone journey. If you have any questions about the life on three or any of the devices that I have reviewed, make sure to put them in the comments uh, below and I'll be interacting with you guys. Um, and there is going to be a period where I'll be gone this upcoming month. So I'll be doing the live stream now at the end of the week, but also in July, it'll be, I'll be intermittent because I'll be traveling a lot. So anyways, I uh, hope, uh, this was helpful and hope I introduce you to at least some services that you can check out, uh, to see if they fit your lifestyle. Have a great day. See you in the next one.